Last month, I stood on these same steps with Prime Minister Sanchez of Spain, and we said that the point of recognising the state of Palestine was coming closer. That point has now arrived. Today, Ireland, Norway and Spain are announcing that we recognise the state of Palestine. Each of us will now undertake whatever national steps are necessary to give effect to that decision. In the lead-up to today's announcement, I've spoken with a number of other leaders and counterparts, and I'm confident that further countries will join us in taking this important step in the coming weeks. This is an historic and important day for Ireland and for Palestine. On the 21st of January 1919, Ireland asked the world to recognise our right to be an independent state. Our message to the free nations of the world was a plea for international recognition of our independence, emphasising our distinct national identity, our historical struggle and our right to self-determination and justice. Today, we use the same language to support the recognition of Palestine as a state. We do so because we believe in freedom and justice as the fundamental principles of international law and because we believe that permanent peace can only be secured upon the basis of the free will of a free people.